Hey, it's John Jansen of WindailySports.com, and hopefully you listened to our advice yesterday. Picks and Pivots, Brian, is on absolute fire. And, well, we gave you Albert Pujols as a potential home run, as a potential player to have into your lineup that's going to be a cheap option. And, well, first at bat since 2019 in St. Louis, where he, of course, is famously known to be playing for, well, hit a home run in his first at bat since 2019, since his last outing in St. Louis. So, big, big night for Picks and Pivots, and we're going to continue that today. Now, taking a look at the pitching options, it's a little difficult because there are a lot of options that just don't seem great. Uh, Freddie Peralta at 10.2K. Look, only threw 53 pitches last time out. That's not something we want to really chase. Shane McClanahan, not really somebody that we want in that price range. Nathan Yavaldi, he's playing the Rays. Absolutely no way. And then you, Darvis, seems like a trap play after what a couple of high, well-known pitchers have done against the Angels. We're not chasing that with Darvish because he seems broken. Really, the best option here is Frankie Montas. And, well, if you want to see why he's the top option, go check out MLB DFS Picks and Pivots. But as for a couple of stacks, the one that we do want to go with is the Kansas City Royals against Matt Harvey. Matt Harvey has not been pitching well. Kansas City Royals could be a cheap option uh, to get, so we like that one. Also, the Tampa Bay Rays against the Evaldi. Talented arm, but Tampa Bay Rays have gotten after a lot of talented arms. Randy Rosarena has been put on the paternity list lately, and they caught up prospect Josh Lowe. He seems to be the one at such a cheap option because of a player coming up, very new, that you can get into your lineups. For more on all of this, go to MLB DFS picks and pivots and check out windailysports.com on our youtube channel by subscribing windailysports